Alan McGregor. An emotional moment for the man known as Griggs. His last appearance as a Ranger. Newcastle in the traditional black and white stripes, black shorts. 18 goals last season, 18 goals the season before, player of the year last season. He just delivers consistently. Yeah, yeah he's uh, what can I say, you know, I don't think anybody expected James to go on and, and get into the first team as well. So they'll have a say as well. So yeah, it's, it's gonna be it's gonna be tough to get in team, but that's what you want in a football club. It's kind of like a new look to the team, so. It's gonna be it's gonna be really competition for, for places and some of the boys who's been on loan as well, the younger boys, he's been in, uh, incredible as I said earlier, what he's done for the club and how long he has performed. Says so much about Alan McGregor. Here we are, 13 years later, going head to head with the Magpies for his <laughs> testimonial. Yeah, definitely. But I love what you said there that I scored against Alan McGregor. A special night for a special ranger. 505 appearances, 222 clean sheets. Alan McGregor between the sticks. Baylor Ice and Cole McKinnon, some of the youngsters coming through from the academy. They'll know the scoreline just now. To Baylor again, tracked by Jack. It's a darting move there. Takes a bit of watching. He was switched on, Sandro Tonali. The ball just goes astray. But that's perhaps what 70 million euros brings. That wee bit of coming forward again. Passed beyond Alan McGregor. Just stroked into the net. It's a terrific finish. Miguel Almiron breaks a deadlock at Ibrox. There was a sense that Newcastle had found that bit of urgency. They were doing things quicker. Their passes were becoming more accurate. And with 16 minutes in the clock, it's Rangers nil. Newcastle won. Yeah, I think you're spot on, Tom. I think you could see in the last two or three minutes, Newcastle is in between the two centre halves right now, creating a back three. Here we go. Something might be on here. Lammers, twisting, weaving, hits the target. But well coached by Carius. He started to move himself, Peter, and immediately wanted involved in the final third. Yeah, to be fair, good fair play. Laid off on Miron. Pushed long by Shaft. Oh, and look at the space in here. Rangers in trouble. Oh, and it's a terrific intervention. Ultimately from John Souter is Newcastle accurate and carving the opportunity. The box and crosses. Can't even really get him into the game. Here's Lammers in space. Delivers early. Dowell. Oh. And again, he had options. He just tugged at it a wee bit early, perhaps. A few more games under the belt, and that would have been a counter. But again, great movement from Rangers, and it almost paid off. Yeah, that was a good one, that one. I think it's, uh, it's a can't be able to get the ball higher up on the pitch in between the lines. And then, no, it was the Lammers. Lammers again. There, and he turns it. And he ends up getting it. The season really kicks off in earnest to find these combinations and get some confidence going. Yeah. It's a good intervention there again from Dow. Oh, good ball. ball for Cantwell. He's got to save the target. Oh. oh, and he just passes it wide. Well, we talked about combinations. Dowell and Cantwell, teammates at Norwich on the same wavelength. A genuine chance. Wrong side of the upright from Cantwell. Yes. It's actually quite a play quickly from Doyle. He sees it. He sees the run of Catwell, doesn't he? He sees it and uh, it just doesn't get a good connection on it, does he? Unfortunately. Uh, Ibrooks will raise to a man. Alan McGregor, Rangers Hall of Famer. We salute you and thank you for exemplary service. A true icon of Ibrooks. Four league titles. Four Scottish Cups, five League Cups, two European Finals, for the two Cups for Scotland. An emotional Alan McGregor takes his leave, and a special word in the ear of the man who's likely to kind of get into, uh, especially with the newer players, like you said, three new players trying to find information, difficult. Half turn allowed, again his Rangers in the back foot. Lewis, Anderson continues his run, and Ryan Jack, Almiron, and it was a terrific finish along the way, just passed it beyond Alan McGregor. 11 goals last season, he's got the only goal of the evening so far. We'll hand you back to Emma, Alan and Craig of course, for a full analysis of the first 45. The scoreline sets, Rangers nil, Newcastle United 1.
as this fashion Sakala. The referee has us going for the second half. Rangers chasing the game. So only two changes for Rangers. Six for Newcastle. Been replaced. Target's off. Tavernier in for Cantwell. Delivers early. Seema takes a touch. Make it a second chance. Holds it up well. Squeezes it back for Lundstrom. Fancies it from distance. And unfortunately gets it all wrong. So Target is one of the players going on. I think Botman may have left the field as well. Cantwell stands it up for himself and again just a wee bit overconfident yeah. concedes possession kind of quickly Newcastle look to break Gordon will give chase Burton elects not to come Gordon Jack gets a block to play for him at Birmingham you just forget how big he actually yeah. is it's incredible one over the top chased by Anthony Gordon got a trick or two as well Jack Suter good enough yeah. wonderful touch yeah. one goal last season in only 16 appearances yeah, yeah he struggled England under 21 caps yeah. not short of confidence no but he, he struggled to get yeah. into the team of Newcastle when he arrived everybody thought he was going to come and play yeah, first for, for, yeah. for Everton but from when he came from Everton but he struggled to get in the team because Newcastle do so well but then he's now went on the last bit of the season played really good for Newcastle as well and then he done for England in the under 21 is it on 23 so 21, 21 yeah one and he was on fly on, on, on fire then he's on the corners too it's well defended by Rangers Peter was Callum Wilson yeah Callum Wilson's off yeah I've got, I got all the ones who always been off yeah but I haven't got everyone who's on from Newcastle chipped in off the head of Suter Awkward. Still not away. Lewis picks it up. On the spin again is Elliot Anderson in for Gordon. Almiron, he reverse pass. Deflected over the top. Another corner. Three corners in quick succession. Yeah, yeah. It's that kind of play that we've been used to seeing from Rangers, isn't it? With Tavernier and Barisic coming around the outside and crosses in and that's what Newcastle heard and Rangers with at the moment. We are fine. We fashion juniors coming on for Dowell. And it's the straight replacement Balligan for Ben Davies at the heart of the defence. Inventive. <laughs> Wrong side of the upright. He just gone a wee bit early there. Couldn't quite capitalise. But again, the accuracy and passing causing problems for Rangers, Peter. Yeah, they're, again, <laughs> coming around the outside. The fine ring is finding really, really tough to, to kind of stop that from happening. Some game time going there. I should have said, incidentally, Newcastle also changed their goalkeeper, Carol Darlow. Elliot Anderson releasing. This again digs out the delivery. Balogun gets something on it, and heart and mouth moment as it spins across the face of goal in Nicholas. Tavernier. here. The flag's up. He does have a habit of that. Fashion Sakala looking to play on the shoulder, and he can sometimes just be a wee bit over ambitious. He's dribbling stronger, he's understanding. He oh, wants a great to intervention. Oh, Chance for Rangers! Yeah, yeah. We're back on terms! Oh, Sam Lammers pounced on the opportunity, and that's that high press, Peter. Pays the dividend, and he had the composure to slot it beyond the change goalkeeper Darlow. It Rangers 1, Newcastle United 1, joy for Lammers. Yeah, like we talked about earlier, if you get the, the high press right, then you got a really... It's been Marez, though. Mons is one in. Well, that would have been unorthodox from Yanis Adji. Who's caught your eye, Peter, from a Rangers perspective in particular? Um, <laughs> it's, a, it's a hard one, to be fair. Um, well, there's a chance here. It's Fashion Junior on the end of the pass from Alex Lowry. Started again by Raskin. Still Fashion Junior. He may get a break here. Had you a sight of the target. Oh. Tries to wrap his foot around it and it's just wrong side of the goal frame. But again, it was the alert early ball from Nico Raskin. The switch on Lowry gets in behind and it's Fashion Junior. Yeah. He just couldn't escape the clutches of the back tracking defenders. No, I, can't, I, can't, I talked about earlier when Motondo on him. It's the end product, isn't it? Get a trick or two as well. Digs out the delivery. Newcastle restored the lead. The looping header. It goes beyond 
Jack Buckland. The Newcastle fans are absolutely delighted. It was just launched into the net. A cute header. Harrison Ashby. It beats Jack Buckland. And with three minutes left in the clock, it's now Rangers 1. Balogun again. Reads it well. Right. Hadji. Right again. On the run. Away from Byrne. Matondo's ahead. Likewise, Lowry. Bailey Rice is there as well. Lowry might fancy it himself. Oh, and he's hit the target. The keeper does so well. Alec Lowry, no backlift. Terrific effort. 